Afrobeat News people guys, it's me Kelvin. Welcome back to Afrobeat News. You know one source for Afrobeat entertainment and just coming at you. Don't forget guys to like and subscribe as well as turn on post notification and stay tuned for more Afrobeat related entertainment and just coming at you. So guys today I'm going to talk about the one and only Don Jazzy and Bonaboy. Obviously you guys have seen the music video by now, you know, the question music video. If you've not seen it, go check it out. It's a really really dope video, dope song. Bonaboy did this thing. Bonaboy pretty much carried the whole song really really classic song and at this point we can all agree that bonaboy knows how to release hot banging singles so that single was a classic was a hit and it's everything i imagine from a don jazzy bonaboy collaboration do i have to address the fact that don jazzy don jazzy did not did not do well i have to be honest not that he like he didn't sing well his vocals of course is always really good he was just teasing us like throughout the whole song he did not he, like he didn't even drop a verse this guy literally just said two lines and both lines i think are shots at somebody but that's coming later so song is really good bonaboy did marvelously well don jazzy nailed it as well you know just teasing us teasing us just teasing us so yeah guys that's pretty much it anyway i want to really talk about the video actually not the video the the song itself personally i feel those songs contain shots at david o it might not be the case but there's probability there's a high probability that these are shots at david o now if you analyze the song you'll find out that bonaboy was addressing somebody or some of his haters or somebody that is not really in best terms with him certain lines he said especially the most popular line of the song where he said if they like me then chop all the tomato then they will catch up which is like if they like you know they do all they want to do they will never catch up if you guys are on social media you would know that you know bonaboy's fans and whiskey fans most of them they've been dragging david o since bonaboy and whiskey won grammys and uh it seems like they are now ahead they've been dragging david o, you know just like that trying to make it feel like david o is behind or something like that now the next couple of lines which was sung by don jazz himself is more direct shots at david o i think the second line he said was where your baby you pretty much referring to the fact that okay where's your baby where's your lady we all know that of recent there was the major major breakup of david o and choma and now choma is nowhere to be found in david o's life so that's a dig as well as david o next line that came out of don jazzy's mouth was when you go win grammy again another shot at davido if you're looking at it from that sense whiskey has a grammy bonaboy has a grammy but davido has no grammy not even a nomination to his name they, they, they do have none so if you have don jazzy coming out with these two lines you can put two and two together and start saying that yes this is the song that was constructed to take shots or digs at davido and this is not something that's far-fetched for bonaboy bonaboy has been taking digs at davido but he doesn't really take it directly he doesn't really call davido's name doesn't really hint that it is davido but he just make it very very general like way too big for instance it was like you know shots at davido most would seem to think that he was selling shots at davido in way too big but he never really hinted in any way that it was specifically directed at Davido. It could just be generalized and be like, oh, it's, it's anybody that hates him or anybody that doesn't really like his music or something like that. But if you put two and two together, you can always conclude that Bonabo is taking a dig at certain people in the industry that doesn't really mess with him that much. And most likely it is Davido. Now, do I think that Don Jazzy will take shots at Davido? Honestly, I don't think so. Reason because Don Jazzy and David Doe, I think they have some kind of relationship. Tiwa Savage used to be signed to Don Jazzy and Tiwa Savage and David Doe are very, very cool. But Don Jazzy's lines in that song, I don't think Don Jazzy wrote his lines. So if Bonaboy wrote those lines, or since Bonaboy takes pride in writing his music, if Bonaboy wrote those lines for Don Jazzy and Don Jazzy is saying it, he can as well still be taking shots at David Doe without necessarily having the intent of taking shots at David Doe. That song basically, I feel, is just a big shot at david do in general and yeah that's how i feel about it maybe that might not be the case but there's a possibility a strong possibility if you add two and two together the whole grammy shorts the whole 
um, no girl shorts, where's your baby shorts, and the whole you can not catch up. It screams the video, honestly. Anyway, still on Bonaboy, you have the Ultra Arena coming up, which is coming up on the 27th of August. So, just a couple of days from now, London fans must be going crazy right now because they are going to enjoy Bonaboy in his full form. This song that just dropped is, is further going to make the you know the whole experience there very, very elating and very, very exciting to be at. With the question and many many other tracks of the Twice Store album and Afghan Giants is going to be really really massive. And just to let everybody know, like Bonabo actually sold out the O2. I know you know online if you go online basically you would see reports that Bonabo did not sell out things and things. You know fans to make up stuff there. All on true, all on true. Bonabo sold out the O2 arena. So and Bonabo is shutting it down. And to end this video, guys, here's a clip of Bonaboy pretty much rehearsing for Ultra Arena. It's going to be a bit swell time for you know Bonaboy's fans. I heard the clip of Bonaboy rehearsing and it sounds really, really good. It sounds as if it's like the studio version of Bonaboy. So yeah, guys, you're gonna have a few day. Bonaboy is gonna be at the Ultra Arena on the 27th of August and it's gonna be good. And as we get the video, I think the video will be back. The video it's taking its time right now, but definitely we'll be back with the music and more bangers. And hopefully, it doesn't really try to go back and forth with Bonaboy because I think this beef between David and Bonaboy is just exhausted. It's been gone too long. Just let it go and let's move on. Anyway, guys, this is pretty much Bonaboy we have seen. And don't forget, guys, to like, subscribe, turn on post notifications, and stay tuned for more info beach related entertainment and just coming at you. I'm also now, guys. Peace.